Hello YouTube, welcome to Open TTD with Leutnant Joker and we're continuing near Günzburg. Now as I mentioned, we're going to add a little food to what we already have. Now we have petrol going on, we have goods delivered to our cities and since we have a nice little plant here right in front of our cities, let's try and use that. So this guy needs livestock. Now, I already checked down here, I can quickly get my transparency options down here. <clears throat> there we go. Cargo for Legend, we're going to need that soon. Now, I didn't um, actually turn these into smaller circles, well this one not um, by any chance, but um, this one and this one. I could have changed these to be a small loop also instead of this double loop but I noticed that the livestock is actually not coming from these these are grain and sugar beet the livestock is also coming from these so these produce livestock and wool now we're not producing any of the livestock yet we're producing the wool so we already have a line going on I say going on too much don't I we have a line going to these um, sheep farms and I think we should simply extend that one. So let me quickly get one more of these guys. And let me give it a name right off so I don't forget about that right now writing right now again. Where do we where are we in terms of numbering? Nine. That would be number nine. So we can pretty much use our existing network here, existing infrastructure, to get that done. And we're going to simply refit this thing to livestock, and we're giving it the same orders as this one. All the way timetable, and we're going to do the same with this one. Except that this one, which one is coming up here? This one. Okay, so this guy is going to give, take the orders of this guy. Probably have to delete that first. Yeah, there we go. Automate and go. So now these guys will try to get the livestock as well to the station. How many we need of those? Uh, by the way, I wanted to change something else here. Come on, get out of the way. I wanted to somehow do it like like this. I get rid of that building there. This is a bit more ideal because I don't really like this part of the line coming out of the town. Um, I don't need that entire piece. So now they pretty much avoid the entire town, don't tinder the buses, and only in the last portion they go into the depot. That is a bit better, I believe. And we're also closer to a point where we can link up the other farms. Here we're probably gonna need a bridge to get to this one, but for now this is fine. And they are pretty long, so I don't want them to interfere with our buses and stuff in the town. This way they avoid most of that. And they're farm trams, so they should go through the farm country for most of the distances. So now we're getting livestock delivered here. Do we already have some here? No, but should probably arrive pretty soon. Now the livestock well, how do we get the livestock to this guy? I don't really want a train going this short distance. I think that's a little... That's a little inefficient. Well, it might be efficient, but that's a little silly. I mean, would you put a train for this amount of distance? I mean, we had trains going from here to here initially. So you could probably argue something like that, but... I don't really know. How would we, where would we put the tracks and put that in work and... Uh... 
I don't know. At this point, I feel that would probably not be the ideal situation. So how do we do that? Looking at this layout... Looking at this layout, I'd probably do something like this. Now, how do we get over here? Because the ideal situation would be if you had something similar going down here. And we could probably connect that up there. And we'd need a bridge over here. It was a way too expensive bridge, by the way. And we need another one. Over there. Now, how do we connect this up to there? I really don't want to go through this because that's kind of where where the people live. It's going through the, the, the populated area. So can we have a bridge somewhere like here? Something like this maybe. would be fine. You just need to be a little bit careful that this town doesn't start connecting this up to here because I don't really want that and I might be able to prevent that from happening by... well, no, not a sign. I don't want a sign. I wanted to... what is that actually? Purchase land. I wanted to do that. Kind of purchase this here. Just for future precaution, so we don't get any connection to this road, because then um, all the cars would stop using um, using the autobahn. I don't want that right now. So we need livestock trucks. Let's hope we have trucks that can deliver livestock. Yes, we do. Why can't I refit you? Oh, you already are fitted, okay, you can only carry that stuff. Then you, my friend, are going to load up there and you are going to deliver up there. And we'll automate your timetable and you're not going through the town, so you can pretty much... Well, you're not going on the Autobahn either, so I'll give you a speed limit of 100. Well, actually... I'm a little embarrassed. How fast are trucks allowed to go on normal roads in Germany? 80 or 100? Oh, who cares? Let's do go 100. They go 100 in reality anyway, so... So let's start with 4. Well, let me quickly delete that. Wow, no, I didn't want to... Get another one. Come on. I wanted to name you first, my friend. I wanted to name you first. Livestock truck one. Now I want to clone you. And go. So these guys should now deliver livestock from our station where it is already waiting, as you can see, probably without a target yet, yes. And they should be delivering up here. Now this thing will produce food. Now where do how do we get the food into the towns? Also with trucks. Now the question is where are our food accepting stations? Now that is accepting one. Let me quickly get to my road depot. I need a food truck and you I probably have to refit yes food truck um uh, 
There we go. And you, my friend, are going here. And... Here we said, I believe. Yes, that's a food accepting station. That's a bus station. That one doesn't accept food. This one doesn't accept food either. And that one neither. So we only have that one. Which is fine. And he was the Autobahn so he doesn't get any speed limit but he gets an automation. Then we need the next one which will go to Gunsburg. Alright, what do we have here? Those are three three petrol stations and that thing is still not accepting food. Hmm. Okay. Let's see, what else do we have here? Okay, but that doesn't have a cargo station, so we need a cargo station down here for the hotel. Where do we put that best? It would be ideal if I get both hotels in one go, so I put that in there. So you go here, and you go back to load. What else do we have? The petrol station should be accepting, yes. Do we have anything else? This one is accepting, okay. That was Ginsburg Central, right there. That's the petrol station. What about this one? This one also accepts. Wow, this is... North, where is it? There we go. Oh, this is actually quite a bit of a delivering system. Okay. Gunsburg has lots of food stations. Now... Where are we here? North? doesn't accept. Transfer has a hotel that should be accepting, yes. Which one is that? That one. I have too much stuff on the screen. There we go. That is accepting. What else do we have here? That has lots of... Didn't these guys accept food if you had enough of them? Oh no, they had accepted goods if you had enough of them, okay. But here are hotels and we don't have any station down there. So we will put one in. And we actually... Well, no. But we could could also include one of, the hot one of the petrol stations or two. But I don't want that. I want just a hotel here. So we go back to load up. And then we go here, and that's pretty much it, right? Yes, okay, that for that, automate, and let's get rid of all this crap, clone one more for Schifferstadt, this one should be accepting, this one should also be accepting, but it is not a cargo station, so we'll put one in. I could have actually named that the same. I mean, make that one the same. That's central. There we go. What else do we have? That should pretty much be it. If I'm not mistaken. Halt doesn't. Oh, Halt accepts also. Okay, so central accepts, Halt accepts, and east accepts. Well, that was this one. This one was also high run, right? Yeah. Okay. So this one will go to east. Load up. Central. Load up. 
And where's Halt? Halt is here. Okay. Automate. Okay, do we need another one? We probably need another one down here because I think our hotel accepts food. East doesn't accept food. This one doesn't accept food either. So we only need one here. One delivery. To the hotel. Alright. Let's go. Ah, damn it. Didn't want to delete everything. There we go. All right. Actually, what am I doing? I just told all these guys to load the food up here, didn't I? That's, of course, absolutely wrong. But we can fix that when we do the grouping, because we need groups for all these guys anyway. About right, and that was live stock. Also sounds right. That was also live stock. Food truck. Let's lift, do the livestock trucks first, and this is the wrong way around. the stockyard yes those are all the livestock trucks so all should end up in here right and those are all different food trucks and they deliver from Schifferstadt I actually did the deliver from Heilbronn because we're going to end the, to enter that, yeah, to change that. In case you don't know, Ender is the German word for change, so I was a little multi-language disturbed right now. That is food. And you my friend are not going to load up here but you're going to load up there go right back to that because everything else you're doing don't make any sense Sorry for this um, correction that I have to do here, but uh, I'll try to be as fast about it as I can. Upon Schifferstadt, is that actually what you're doing? Sounds right, but it's probably Heilbronn local. Yes, it will be Heilbronn local. local Schifferstadt, right? Yes. So that will be food from... No. From Heilbronn to... Jesus. I always get the period. To Schifferstadt.
Yes, looks right. One more. Where did you end up? There we go. And again. Okay, so much for that. Lots of traffic going on. Let's see whether that is flowing as intended. I have to mention this, by the way, I'm a complete idiot because Bandicam is actually showing me the recording length, so all my work with the timer and all that kind of crap was completely unnecessary. I always could have checked what my recording time is, so sorry for that. And I also think we're not yet done with blowing up cinemas in this town. I think they still have way too many. planes landing and as you can see this airport is already incredibly busy these guys are in waiting loops so we have to um, do something about that eventually okay these guys have had time to go around a little bit let me check what a livestock is doing now what on earth of this is livestock no idea so I'm going to to try them all. Oh yes, I should probably have checked my company color, of course, first. Okay, that's the wool that I don't want. That was food. Okay, that's livestock. Well, that's dark green, that's fine. That seems to be exactly good. Now from here to the factory or the uh, stockyard. What the hell is a stockyard anyway? I have to get look that up. I have no idea what a stockyard is. Um, so that connection is absolutely not fine, which means these guys, this is an orange, so I think doubling it should probably do the trick. This was food, and yes, now I have all these unused lines, which hope hopefully will vanish anytime soon. These are all in the grain, which probably means we're not producing enough yet, and the trucks are more than enough, so we have to kind of boost that a little bit. So let's that we'll let that run for a while. Actually, let's just run that for a while. Just so, and I'm going to do some stuff in between. Um, someone told me, by the way, I should not forget to rename my company in 1949. That's actually a good point. Thank you for reminding me. I would have totally forgotten about that. And I think in a few days we'll actually be at that. I'm not exactly sure when in 1949 uh, Deutsche Bundesbahn was founded. Probably the, roughly the same time the uh, new German state was uh, created. I'm kind of embarrassed to say that I don't know the exact date of that anymore. Was that... I don't remember. I knew that once. <laughs> I've read way too much World War II stuff. I should read a lot, a lot more post-war stuff again. I completely forgot all about that. But I will just do it on the 1st January. 1st of January. Because now, right now, I'm reminded of it, and otherwise I'll forget it again.
but we should I have some more one more circle in mind here I have one more circle in mind and I'm just thinking about hmm I was thinking about creating a circle Heilbronn, Rigger Spreitling and Jensen Amberg the, the thing is Amberg is so small and there's already a buzz line going to Heilbronn and that bus line, if you look at the passenger thing, is already maxed out with one bus. It's over maxed out actually. And we need a few more premium trains, I just noticed. So let's do that right now. Let's go on one more of these premium guys. Um, one thing, so linking this guy up is kind of, kind of unnecessary I believe so if you link up Jensen we could actually go up to Mannheim could go up to Mannheim how is this line up here this line is next to not used at all so linking that up to Mannheim is also not a very good idea but we could link this up to Mannheim would have a connection up here that's actually uh, something that we could do oh my god and the first thing well I should probably not blow up their their cinemas before I get a bus line going but as soon as I have something going on in there I will blow up those stupid cinemas with my little code change they can't prevent me from buying stuff anymore but um, Let's start with one bus. I never know how much these guys need. There we go. Where are we in terms of names? Lots of city buses. 63. go you already have your orders go and then we need a train station for this guy too let's say I'll put that for now well, now we can build the suburban stations hmm. well this should probably be a Rural station. We've had good success with those, and we'll do one of these for starters. And we wanted low speed. And we need low speed, and we'll just connect that up with our cargo line down here. Since there's not much going on there, linking that up should be perfectly fine. I want a cargo lane down, going down here though, so I can link this guy up. So I'm not going to connect Amberg, but I'm going to put a line down there. And to do that... This is not gonna bite me in the ass. I'm doing this because I need to go below this guy.
And I shouldn't do that with high speed track. Because I still want that to be a little bit of a loop. Kind of like this. So I can have this one as a one directional track. Completely don't see what I'm doing anymore. There we go. So I have this one as one directional track and this one also as one directional track. And this one as normal track. I may upgrade this if I need more than one train here. For, for now, I'm going to just put one train on here. And... How do I link that up? Do I put this one into the loop? Hmm. If I put this one into the loop, then I also need a connection down here. And then I need some way to cross here. Probably wondering what the hell is he doing. We'll find out soon enough. <laughs> Thinking about this a little bit myself right now. down here as well. And we can probably copy this guy to get the name. He's not in the group yet anyway. And this guy should actually go to the bus station, uh, to the train station as well. There we go. Okay, so let's see how this works. We want a passenger train, and for that, I believe the current one
You know what? Should we try the diesel? Uh, five minutes over anyway. Okay, tell you what, folks. Since I'm five minutes over anyway, I'm going to cut the episode here. And I'm going to pause and I'm going to save. And I'm going to say, since we already have 1949, let me quickly do this before I forget that again. There we go. I'm going to use the rice bomb backup. And next time, we'll put the train in. And until then, I'm going to look up which is the best locomotive for that. So until then, I say, keep your heads up, folks. We're going to keep expanding. See you next one. <laughs>